Hey Southway, good to see you guys through our midweek uh, vlog. And with this week's edition of our vlog, I want to give you a preview for what's coming up during our Sunday morning worship gatherings. We're just about to end Hosea. Uh, we have one last sermon coming up on May 29th, but then on June 5th, uh, we get to go on a new adventure together through the New Testament book of Jude. Jude has become one of my favorite books of the Bible. I know it's weird to say you have a favorite book of the Bible. Isn't all of it God's Word? Yes, thank God that we get all of it. But just in, in going through Jude these last couple of months and getting ready for this series, it's given me a new uh, affection for, for Jude and what he wrote. Jude was one of the brothers of Jesus, who while Jesus was on earth, he didn't even think Jesus was who Jesus said he was. He thought Jesus was crazy. And then Jesus rose again, and that changed everything for Jude. And so Jude is writing a letter, 25 verses. So why are we going through this book? Why now? Well, here's a couple of reasons. One, does it give us a sense of accomplishment? Over the last few years, we've gone through some big books. We had 28 chapters in Acts. It took us almost two years. It's taken us nearly six and a half months to get through the book of Hosea. We're going to be able to, Lord willing, get through Jude and still have some summer left over after we're done. But also Jude has some important themes that we, as followers of Jesus Christ need to think about, need to dwell on, need to be changed by. One is that our faith, we're not, there's no time for apathy. We have no room for it. We need to be active in, in sharing our faith. We're also active in contending for the faith. One of the biggest themes of the book of Jude, in fact, we're calling this series Contenders. Why? Because all of us are called to contend, to fight for the faith. We're called not to just be letting things go by. We're called to contend. And how in the world can we contend for the faith? Because Jesus Christ didn't just contend for us. He conquered sin and death for us. We're supposed to be an active people. Apathy is of, of no place in, in our hearts. And, and we rejoice in the fact that we can contend for the faith because Christ has conquered sin and death for us. So we get started with Jude on June 5th. We'll be going uh, through the end of June and early into July. And I cannot wait to, to bring this series. And I cannot wait for you and I as we discover what God would have for us in Jude together.